Um, this is the Plastic Logic 100 device, which uh, has an uh, e-ink display with uh, plastic backplane electronics. So the last time I demonstrated a product like this, this was a display still in the lab. Um, now we've progressed quite a bit. We now have a device, a plastic display, and an actual e-reader device. This is an electronic textbook device. The beauty of this technology is it's all plastic, no glass, uh, won't shatter, extremely light. So you can see I can hold it with one hand and I can use the other hand to write. And sure enough, it has the writing feature in it. So I can annotate, I can uh, write notes on the side, and pretty much all the kinds of features that students requested in this particular device. The beauty of a device like this is it is replacing your entire library. It has thousands of books that you can store. It has all the content pre-approved by the teacher or by the school district that's loaded on this. There's no viruses, there's no students are not web surfing, they're not playing games. This is a replacement for a textbook device and it's just better than the textbooks. This is your better textbook. How many books will it hold? It'll hold several thousand books and uh, you have access to a lot of content that you can get depending on the geography and depending on the school district and so on. Clearly what you're doing here is you're not replacing one or two or ten books, you're replacing an entire library with one of these devices. And the battery life, you uncertain? But ba you... Battery life is um, several days or weeks. Uh, in similar other devices, we have battery life of up to two months on a single charge. So in this particular case, the challenge you're going to have is you may not remember where your battery charger is when you next have to charge it. Uh, a lot of these devices, if you charge them now, the next time you need to charge them is in 2012.